Okay, so if you're here, it's because you want to know how you can migrate a subscription from one tenant or directory to another. So to get started, I have this tenant test 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 YT 2023. If I go to subscriptions over here, you'll see that I have no subscriptions at this time. And if I were to add it because of the way my current tenant is set up and I don't want to obviously pay for anything else, it's going to direct me to another main tenant in which I can create a subscription and transfer it over here. Okay, so I'm at my current tenant that has a subscription. You can see over here, Microsoft Partner Network is the name of it. We can go click on subscriptions and then go to MPN. Okay, so right before we make the transfer, let's go ahead and check the resources that we have. Okay, so we have the list over here and what we expect to have is that once we transfer to the new directory or tenant that we would have the same resources available there and just remember this is still code doge yt tenant so now that we're here all we have to do is click on change directory and over here this new blade's going to show up if you click on the drop down it's going to give you a list of directories to choose from. In this case, I want to use test, 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 YT 2023. Click the disclaimer and click on change. Okay, so now that we've done that, if you go back to the original tenant of test, 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 YT 2023, you'll see that the MPN subscription has moved over. So you can see that there's unauthorized and sufficient privileges to see billing data and unauthorized. These errors should go away in 10 to 15 minutes when the subscription has completed transferring over to this new tenant. So now if we go to resources, we should expect to see all the resources that was in the old subscription inside this subscription. And sure enough, we do see all the resources have been moved over. And now if we navigate back to the old uh, tenant, Code Doge YT, and we go to resources, we see that there are no resources here because they've been moved to the new tenant. Okay, so some time has passed um, back inside the subscription for test, test, test YT 2023, and we see that everything that once said insufficient privileges is now resolved, and you can see everything as you need to. So I just want to bring attention to one of the potential errors you might see during the migration, which is what you're looking at the screen right here about no access. Uh, likely this is actually going to disappear once the tenant has completed its transfer. I mean, the subscription has completed its transfer to the new tenant. So basically just wait it out a little bit. Okay, so there's kind of only one last thing I want to show that might be relevant for you. Maybe, maybe not. If you go to manage tenants and you click on the tenant that we're currently at, you have the option to leave the tenant or delete it. So that's very important for cleanup. All right, so that pretty much sums it up for this video. Pretty straightforward. Uh, if you happen to need it, there's another video that tells you how to create a new Azure tenant. Um, the link is inside the video description. Otherwise, feel free to check out the other videos I might have. Hopefully, it's useful, and hopefully, I've earned your subscription. Otherwise, have a good one and take care.